Well, even though this bastion is complete doo-doo, we still need bastions to get advancements, so I'm going to go in and try not to fall into the lava on the bottom floor, because that would be very, very bad. But so far, I've been playing this mostly just, you know, trying to get to the end and do what we have to to beat the dragon and eventually get an elytra, because everything gets made a lot easier once we get an elytra. That said, I did make some notes for today wanting to, there we go, those were the days, get some advancement slash progress on advancements where we can. So also actually before I'm in here, I should probably get a bit of lava in the bucket so that we can deal with brutes without upsetting everybody. Although at the same time, like I do need to actually like manually kill a brute for the mob advancement. That's one of the big ones where you have to kill every single mob. So we're not gonna get the advancement here, but it's one of many towards the objective. I'm right, looking out for brutes because if one drops on our head here, we're gonna have a very, very bad time. I mean, there's bound to be some in the area that has like some of the loot and what. Not, I'm not seeing any around here. Are we good? Um, I could do a piglin trade. I could get oh shiny, but I don't know that I want to do oh shiny where there's like a bajillion piglins around who will all get mad at me at the same time. We also uh, looting a chest is an advancement, and I want to get some glowstone so that we can make a respawn anchor because I'm sure if we do trade, well, we have very limited gold, so maybe not. Um, if I could find any gold blocks, I could do a trade, and I'm sure we'd get some Crying Obsidian. We could make a respawn anchor and then fill it up, get an advancement there, trying to plan things out. God, that is a terrible place. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, I, I also haven't killed a Hoglin yet, so... Okay, nice slabs right there. Making it hard to build. All right, what do we got? What do we got? Because we need, um, what is it? Three glowstone for the center, and we need four glowstone to fill it up, so I need a little bit more. Oh, hey, buddy. Yikes. Please don't eat me in the lava. That's going to be bad news for me. Oh, God. He's done. Okay. That was a little scary. You know, there's just a, there's just a bit of lava down there as a risk to fall into if things go bad. But hey, there's a hoglin down. Cool. That's one out of many on the mob killing advancement that we got to get. So that, that'd be, that'll be enough. Cool. At least we're mostly full diamonds. So, um, are there any chests down at the center? Anything? I did see the chest to loot over here. Let's block ourselves in. Oh, there's a brute. All okay. right. I mean, here's the thing, right? Like, I have to kill a brute somewhere in a bastion, and everyone is going to be mad at me for doing it, but I have to do it at some time. The question is, like, do I just wait until I have full netherite so that I can be a little bit more protected, or do I just YOLO it here at this point? Where was that chest that I saw? earlier. I want to be a little careful. Hoglin's trying to yeet me into lava. Oh, it's right over there. Okay. okay. Cool, 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 cool. Hey, buddy. Can't reach me from there, can ya? Get wrecked. I gotta be, I gotta be prepared. Gotta be big, big prepared. There's another chest over there. Another chest over there. Okay, he's gonna... There we go. Oh, he can reach me. He can reach me. Everything's fine. Everything is fine, everybody. There's no problems here. <laughs> Maybe I don't want to. Maybe I don't want to punch him and get everybody else mad at me while I'm at my my current health. Maybe not. This could be an option to get oh shiny though. At the same time, even if I can't do trade and get the obby and stuff like that. So I'm gonna need to make a new pickaxe too. This thing's about to be busted. Oh, there's another man over there. <laughs> okay, I'm taking a quick look around. Do they see me? Do they see me? Okay, we got we got double trouble here. If I can get a last hit, right? If I can get a last, I also have to be a little bit careful about the. They've both made the collective decision that they would prefer for me not to make progress on the Monster Hunter advancement by manually slaying them. <clears throat> All right, that's fair enough. Um, that's fair enough. <laughs> I'm just like, I'm, I'm, we're gonna go. We're gonna go. We see your lava bucket. I'm just gonna, just gonna take the coward's way out. All right. Cool. There's a, there's a man's over there. Okay, so here's the deal. If we just um, block ourselves in here, let's open up the chest and get ourselves the advancement there. Okay, great. War pigs. Ooh, some soul speed three. A little bit of iron, a little bit of food, magma cream. I We do need the magma cream in order to make. Do we need to make? I can't remember all the advancements. It's just, it's just apply all potion effects at once, but do we need the magma creams for that? I'm going to run out of inventory space here any moment, so I guess I don't really need the bones since we have all the bone blocks anyway. So, yeah. Is anybody upset right now? No. 
Nobody's upset. Why would you be upset? There's no reason to be upset. We're all friends here. Let's go get the other chest. It could have some good stuff in it. You never know. And then we'll probably try to loot whatever we got up there. Hey, buddy. Um, I wish that I could offer you lots of gold so you can give me ender pearls, but can you see? I never remember, like, can they see through a gap in the stairs? A little bit of this, a little bit of that. <laughs> Just, um, boop, boop, and boop. You see nothing. He doesn't see anything. This is great. Good news. Do I need any more of that stuff? I don't think so, but I'll take the close stone since I already did a get an inventory slot. All right, pleasure doing business with you guys. Thank you for being so accommodating. Now the big question is, do I, how do I enter the top part if I want to loot the stuff up there? I know I'm not looting this at a speedrunner's pace, but I'm trying to stay alive. And as you saw, it got dicey there for just a second. God, I wish I, I wish I knew where all of the, you know, where all the, there are obviously hidden pieces of gold and stuff like that. I just wish I knew where those were because it would make my life significantly easier here. Um, anyway, here we go again, running out of blocks. Okay, nobody sees anything. Great, good news, another gapple. Well, actually, why don't I have the gapples in my inventory? That, that wouldn't be a bad idea. That would not be a bad idea. Curse of Vanishing, yeah, you know what I like more than a gold axe? A gold axe that disappears when I die in a hardcore world. Terrible curse to deal with when you're... Oh, I thought that was a brute, that's a brute. That is a brute, that is a brute over there though. Okie dokie, hold on just a moment. One sec, are we getting chased? Are we getting chased? That was a little bit <laughs> scary. It's gonna drop on my head. I gotta be careful of that, mans. I would like to get the kill on him manually, you know? There we go. All right, all right, all right, let me see. Can what? How did he get me? How in the frick did he just get me? Okay, oh God, frick. Are we good? Is he still on me? I do not know if he's still on me, if he gained the ability to parkour, found a more efficient way across. How did he hit me? My mans can jump. I don't like it when my mans can jump like that. Let me get some netherrack over here for some, you know, uh, additional block abilities. Holy frick, that was scary. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, I'm just not being careful enough around the brutes. Hey, you know, while we're over here, I could just get a little sneaky oh shiny. How about that? How about that? Hey, buddy, here. Um, ooh, shiny. Wow, that's so cool. <laughs> Please don't be mad at me after this. And then, if you give me Ender Pro... I was about to say, if you give me ender pearls, I will spare you. And he knew, he knew, I just held him hostage. <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> Cause I was gonna be like, you know what? You'll be the guy who, uh, you know, satisfies the piglin kill in the monster hunter. Nope, nope. You get, you're free to live your life. Enjoy it. Have a great one. I hope it's very fulfilling because you're, you're a brilliant fellow right there. What a guy, what a guy, what an incredible guy. That was amazing. Okay, holy frick, I'm never gonna get Ender Pearls ever again after that. I need to leave gaps here so I can parkour away from my boy in there because he is, and you on the other hand are not nice and I would be more than happy to end you. However, there's mans right around you. Hey buddy, wait, no, he's not, wait. Uh, I kinda wanna lure him out. Hey bud, hey, hey, I see you, hey, come here. Yo, what are you guys doing? Oh my God, man. Soon as I'm prepared for them, soon as I'm prepared for them, they just can't seem to figure out how to get over here. All right, you cannot reach me. You cannot reach me, that much I know. And you're done. I'm not, I can't risk the, there's too many dudes around here. I can't risk the actually slaying him. Okay, bye-bye. Is there, I don't actually even think there's much of a reason for me to be risking going through here when I, like, I'm not getting the gold that I need and stuff like that. So it's kind of just dumb, probably. Brutes, 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 any brutes, any brutes, any brutes. Hello, hello, are we, we're, we're good? God, there's so many, there's so much noise. But, build another house. Nobody knows, nobody knows. Arrows are good, another gapple, very good. More iron, I guess that's okay. I'm so worried that I'm gonna, I'm gonna break open my little thing here. And it's just gonna be like a peekaboo, it's a brute on the other side. Might be overkill, like they, they probably don't actually see me right now and they just have, they have no idea and I'm like, I'm fine. And I'm being completely overcautious at the moment, but what can you do? Um, sharp, oh my freaking God, that is actually incredible. What a, what a play, what a maneuver. We've just got ourselves a, an efficiency for pickaxe. Okay, yes, please, I will take that 
And then this thing has 40 durability left. Yeah, honestly, I almost think the inventory slot's worth more, but I guess I can hold it right there. Like, what are we gonna actually do with this thing later? But holy frick, efficiency four, let's go. Uh, oh, you freaking goddamn, you know what? It's an opportunity to get Monster Hunter on the ghast, right? And a return to sender, actually. Ye oh my god, I almost swung at the piglin. Come on! Okay, come on. Batter up, batter up, batter up. God dang it, you freaking. I hate this! Okay, you know what? Maybe I'm just gonna do this for now. Yikes. Huh. Ah! I hate you! Okay, that's a gas. God, I'm freaking up! Oh, It was too long range. It was way too long range there. That was annoying. Well, surely, you know what? When we're doing um, Uneasy Alliance, I'm sure that we're gonna run into some, some great opportunities to get Return to Sender there as I'm pulling my hair out, having to edit out a two hour long session down into like t two minutes. That's what's gonna happen when it comes to Uneasy Alliance, the most frustrating advancement in the game. I know there, yeah, there's more, there's more, there's more, there's more. Uh, no brutes, skis, no brutes, no brutes, no brutes, please, no brutes. No brutes are allowed in here. What do we got? Hey, Crying Obby, I still need some more, but Netherite Scrap, that's big for us. I don't know, do I need the Magma Cream? I'm not really sure. It is what it is, but that's good, that's good. Yeah, okay, really, perfect. I mean, I could do, I could do a few more trades, just, I, I, I can try to hold, hold the man's hostage, you know, once more and just, See how it plays out for us. Um, guys got any uh, ender pearls? Hey, hey man. Um, if you guys don't mind here, just uh, bringing it in, bringing it in real quick. You know, just hop on in there. Hey, you guys just hop on in there real quick. Easy peasy, you know, jump on in, get on in there. You, you're not paying attention. I, I have goodies for you. I literally, I have goodies for you. There we go. <gasps> oh my God, dude, what is going on? I swear I'm not playing on 1.16.1. Okay, everyone's gonna be like, holy mods folder moment, but I swear this is wild. This is the craziest thing I've ever seen. I almost am not happy about this because it's gonna be like that moment that happened a while ago where I got the three wither skeleton skulls from four wither skeletons with no looting on my sword and everyone was like, this looks suspicious. Oh my god, I just, oh my god. I can't, you know what's happening is they don't want me to be able to get the Monster Hunter uh, progress. They're like, please spare us, sir. We see that you're on a quest to get all the advancements and, and we'd rather stay alive. We know that you need to take out a piglin and we don't want to be that piglin. So carry on your day. All right, so we are gonna have to go and um, find another bastion, obviously. We're gonna have to get to a treasure bastion at some point. Oh, there's another chest over there. Let me hit it up. We're gonna have to get to a treasure bastion at some point to get like the armor trim and stuff like that. Um, so our our time in bastions is not over, but is anyone mad? Is anybody mad? No brutes. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I'll be ready to dip at a moment's notice if need be. Block that off. Oh, hey, yo, can you just here? Yeah, get it, get on, get on the other side there. Get it, get it, go, go, go away. Okay, thank you, thank you. You see nothing. Okay, there we go. Wow. This is actually pretty cool. And there's even there, but wait, there's more. Uh, and I have the crying obby to be able to make the respawn anchor, fill it up, so on and so forth, so that's good. I can kind of do that wherever because it's not like we're actually gonna be using it to respawn, right? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, more gold. One moment, let me just turn that into bars. I don't even, I think I actually don't remember how many. I, I can put this back in. I don't remember how many ender pearls I have back at home, uh, but, I feel like we've, I feel like we've done what we need to do here. I'm feeling very satisfied. You know what? We have really made the most of a stables bastion. Truly, not bad. Not a bad turnout at all whatsoever. I think let's just, yeah, let's just get rolling um, back. I believe that is the way down there. Oh, uh, you know, let's do the respawn anchor here so that if I, if I mess up going across the lava, I'll, I'll, I'll be able to <laughs> get back, <laughs> right? Okay, here we go, and fill her up. Cool, cool. All righty. Also, like, I guess I could just, you know, mine out here. We, we got gold here, right? I might as well, uh, maybe not mine it out, because it's just gonna fall into lava, but uh, I was thinking there's not really any pigs watching us right now. What I can do is, on the way back, you know, every every piglin I come across, I, I offer it a, a, a trade deal, right? They give me ender pearls, I, don't kill it. 
I think that's a pretty good trade deal, honestly. So um, <laughs> let's uh, let's do it. I'm sure we're gonna run across some on the way back. And also, I wanna I wanna take a quick step into the basalt delta just so we can have that because I know there was one on the way. Like again, once we get the elytra, all the travel related advancements just come really easily. Um, but you know, since we saw the basalt delta, I think it was like right over there. We might as well just do it. You know, one small step for man, one giant leap for advancement kind or I'm pretty sure that's what Neil Armstrong said when he landed on the moon because landing on the moon is a pretty uh, big advancement for the humanity 100% all advancements run completion so doesn't seem like there are a lot of uh, uh, piglins sh showing up around here you know I think they may maybe they got, maybe they overheard what I said back there and they're like uh -uh, I don't I don't like that trade offer it seems fairly one-sided um, maybe, maybe we should, maybe we should go, guys. This, he doesn't seem very stable, this fellow. Um, well, anyway, this is a great, you know, now that we have efficiency four here, it's a great opportunity for us to just be able to, uh, grab a bunch of easy blocks, and then if we get efficiency four on a, another pickaxe, we can combine these, even pre-village, to get efficiency five, which will be very, very nice. I think more gold, more gold. I realized like I could have done some more trading over there, but I also just like didn't want to stretch my luck too far. It was that was the most profitable bastion in a short amount of time that I, I've ever ever been in, in terms of getting ender pearls. I should say that was staggering, truly, truly staggering. All right, here was the Basalt Delta. As always, the last biome that I find is the Blue Raspberry Forest. I don't know what it is. Like, if it is genuinely more difficult uh, or more rare than, than the others or not, but it's, it just seems like it's almost always the last biome I find. Although I will say, the fact that a Basalt Delta is, is the fourth out of five is... It's welcome and unusual. I, I need to grab one of these for monster kill anyway, so... Uh, anyway, please don't... Please don't end me. That will be bad. All right, there we go. Sheesh. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. Okay, I'm gonna go this way. They have no fear of, of heights, so yeah. I think that counted. Let me double check, let me double check. Are we, are we good? I just wanted to make sure like any, any size counts. Yes, we are good, confirmed, good to go. Um, I saw, my path was like over here. No, no getting lost, please. Here we go, return to sender, return to sender. Get freaking wrecked. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, boys. Do we get, wait, 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 wait. Did we get a ghast here? Cause we could use that for a potion or something like that. Mm, nope, just gun pow pow. I mean, a couple gun pow pow, but I think I saw a piglin over here. Hold on, I have to find it and give it a trade offer. <laughs> oh, hello. Hey man, Um, trade offer. You give me ender pearls. I don't kill you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, wrong answer. Wrong answer, buddy. All right. Well, um, got it. Uh, got it. Got it. Got it. All right. Hey, man. Hey, man. Hey. Uh, trade offer. I give you Ender pearls. Um, or you give me Ender pearls. I don't kill you. Wrong answer. Okay. It took it took it took some tries, but we made we made it. Oh my god. Um, I don't know. I just can't remember how many Ender pearls I have back at home. I think I, I think I have a couple. So it's like it's a slight risk to go for the uh, to to go for the stronghold like as it stands. I'm wondering if I should do just a couple more. Hey man. Hey 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 hey. You guys you guys here. I got offers for you. Come on. Get in, get in there, get in there, get in there, get in there. And then, then, then there's an, a frick, it didn't go in. I got here, come on. Hey, there we go. I'm just gonna get like one more set and now I can almost like promise you, I am not, I am simply not gonna find any more ender pearls. My luck, my luck is over. There is no way after what we have just encountered that, that we're gonna have more showing up. I will take a fire resist pot though, that's nice. It's not a bad one. Do I need this any? I don't think I need that. RIP, farewell. Oh, I could give it to them actually. Hey, you guys want a pickaxe? Here's a here's a pickaxe. Oh, also here's the rest of the gold and take a pickaxe, freebie. You know, who said I wasn't generous with you? I happen to think I'm extremely nice. I forget, is walking on powdered snow an advancement? Should I just give them all the, all the gold? Maybe I should just give them all the gold. Come on, let's go Ender Pearl. Splash Potion of Fire Resist, kind of cool, kind of nice. Ender Pearls are not, they just drop the boots and put them on. Nice job, bud. 
It's good. It's good stuff. You're done. You know what? Just, just here, here. Who needs gold anyway, right? It's not like I'm gonna make a beacon out of it or something like that. Right? That would be that would be silly. You fool! Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. This freaking guy. Oh my god. Um. Okay. So guys, this is an awkward situation to be in. It's a very awkward situation. This is a very awkward spot to be in. How are we gonna play this, hey? Um, how are we how are we gonna play this? They're a little distracted by the gold. That worked out. Appreciate you guys. Thank you. Ten ender pearls it is. <laughs> We're just gonna go with that. Alright, have a nice day, fellas. Oh, there I did actually I want to go and get some wort in there as well, so we can, you know, local brewery, all the use and stuff. So this might be a better entrance to the interior um, than the other area. Let's give it a, let's give it a try. Suppose I could just, uh, if we wanted to be real careful, I could just put on the fire resist and then I wouldn't have to worry about any sneak snipes from blazes. Oh, hey, yeah, that'll work. That will work. I don't think I need that for now. Saddle could be good. Oh God, dude. My inventory space is so limited. It's unbelievable. Uh, What do I wanna, what can I get rid of? What can I get rid of right now? I don't need the glowstone. I'll take the saddle. And then um, also, God, I need space for wart. All right, I think this is all we can really do for our, our trip to the nether here. My inventory is completely full. I can't remember if I brought any soul sand back into the overworld, but you know, we're in a soul sand valley with our portal, so I can just do a quick jump right back in and grab some if I need to plant it. And um, yeah, I'd say all in all, Pretty solid. I didn't know that we were actually going to be exiting here with a, a decent amount of ender pearls ready to go. I think we might just be able to like head straight to the uh, to the, the stronghold. Maybe we'll at least find the stronghold. Whether or not we'll get there with enough eyes remaining will yet to be seen. But one can hope. So let's get out of here. No, 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 no. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. I see you thinking about it. I see you thinking about it. Iskall would not be pleased at your silent projectiles from a distance. Think about Iskall. All right. You wouldn't want to let him down. Uh, you going to give me a spooky, scary skeleton by any chance? That'd be cool. That'd be frick. Oh, God. I thought I was doomed there for a second. Okay. I'm ready to get out of here. Wait, do I want to get another for, let's say, making a brewery? We still have nine left over, so. And then if we want to use one for the fuel, that's another. We'll have eight. I still think we'll be good, probably, with the, the ten that we have. Maybe I'll wait to make a uh, brewing stand and a potion until after we've actually, you know, found the stronghold and we've made sure that we have any spares that we need. Hello, Mr. Portal. It's good to see you again. I didn't even have to look at cords to get back here. Impeccable sense of direction. All right. Whew. Good to be back in the overworld. Look at this beautiful room that we call home here. Time for a bit of sleepy, perhaps. And now I need to sort my inventory. Just think about how many more golden carrots we could have made if I hadn't spent all of that gold on the piglins at the end. Anyway, we can make a few more, at least. Eh, why not? While we're here replenish some of the supply that we lost while we were in the nether, keep us held over for while we're on our trip. And so we have 12 ender pearls. So we gotta either hope that none of them break, which is unlikely, or that we get a, uh, a, a portal that has, you know, at least a little bit filled in, which it just never ends up being the case basically ever for me. But, and here we go, let's make the eyes. Okay, there's big plays, big plays out here. I'm gonna bring these along because we might need to do more. Actually, I'll bring, yeah, I'll bring them all. Why not? We'll come back with shulker boxes and, and amazing inventory space and it's gonna be awesome. There's no way that it wouldn't. Also, uh, perhaps let's make a fresh bow. Does he do it correctly? He does. Oh my God. No wobs, not in the final let's play. Mm -mm. He gets it right. <laughs> Incredible. I could have combined them, but that would have cost money potentially and stuff like that. Or grindstone. Well, anyway. All right. Uh, you know what I could do though? Is we could take some of this beautiful bone blockage that we've got and I could use it to grow a few more carrots so that we have those as a little bit of a, a bonus just in case. All right. That's a pretty good amount there. We have some of the cooked pork chop, the golden apples. We have a boat. I'm going to bring some iron in case we need to make uh, a new shield and I guess I can bring some wood even though, you know, it's not like we're going to have a hard time finding that along the way. Though, I could just try to get there with nether portal. I forgot to take off a resource pack from a Minecraft map that I've been playing. <laughs> One sec. 
Someone was probably very confused there for a second. Okay, we're back to redstone and not bluestone. Also, probably a good idea. Let's bring along some gunpowder. If we find some sugar cane along the way, that way we can make some fireworks and have those while we're in the outer end for when we find the elytra. Should get rid of the lava. So I don't like do a water bucket clutch and die. So that'll be much better. Um, okay, I'm gonna try to do an extremely accurate triangulation with a stronghold calculator so that I don't waste very valuable eyes of ender. Um, so let's wait to be able to sleep and then find a flat area and do that in the morning. Okay, throw number one. Where's it gonna go? Oh, that's easy. And then we do, and then we do this, and then I gotta drop my mouse sensitivity. I'm still like so bad at actually doing a perfect centering, but I, I only have one shot here. This isn't like the random series where I usually have a, a plethora surplus of these, so. Here we go. Accurate, accurate, that's accurate, that's accurate right there, let's go. Okay, angle was negative 97.3. And now we just move down the river a little bit, then we hope that we don't accidentally triangulate to another stronghold because this ha it actually happens to me like way too frequently. It's not cool. Um, okay, so please triangulate to the same stronghold. I beg of you. Yes, okay, good. That looks like a pretty big angle difference too, which is it's good, it's good, we like that. Controls, mouse settings, bring it down again, and no pressure. That's centered. That was centered. Let's go. Okay. Well, unfortunately, the angle difference wasn't as big as I had hoped, and uh, the it's it's kind of far away. It's about two thousand blocks. Um, so, well, at least neither of our eyes broke, which is good. Um, well, let's. I don't know. Do we nether it or do we run? No, I think let's run two thousand blocks uh, because that way, as long as we get there in the overworld, we can make the portal in the room rather than having to worry about like weird portal linkage happening um, in the future. If we build the portal in the nether and then it doesn't go directly in the stronghold, but then I build another portal that's in the room, the portal room, and then it's gonna mess up when we. Tr it, it's gonna be annoying. So that said, well, annoying for me, not necessarily for someone who is well versed in portal connections and stuff like that. Um, but all right, I know I've probably forgotten something, but um, we will hope that we're still good, no matter what. If someone is furiously typing right now, like, holy frick, you're an idiot, you forgot such and such. I, I can get a sheep. Actually, did I pass, I just passed some sheep. I was thinking, let's get some wool really quick. I have the shears on me, because uh, in case we do feel like just setting a spawn in the, the portal room, I'm not sure if it's actually necessary to do. Because I'm probably not going to be making a trip back home until I have an elytra anyway. Let, assuming that we make it to having an elytra, I, I, I might be getting a little ahead of myself. But anyway, I'm actually forgetting that doing this and going through the overworld is helpful for adventure time. And also I can do things like collecting sweet berries and eating those so that it helps with a balanced diet. I am going to have to slay a sheep and cow and do all that stuff, aren't I? I am. There's no getting away from that. We have to for all advancements. Anyway, please lose some hunger so I can eat a delicious sweet berry. Let's take a boat down the mountain. Whee! All right, I mean, uh, what can you do, right? What can you do? I'm really sorry about this, man, but it's just like one of these I eat raw and then one of them I smelt up and you, you gotta do what you gotta do. It's all advancements, you know? All right, we've gone through a meadow here. Do I wanna go? I might wanna just go up there so we get the bottom. There could be a goat. Then I can float the goat, which which is I gotta eat, I gotta eat raw chicken actually, don't I? I don't think I've done that yet. I'm sorry about this, man. I I appreciate you. Uh, as punishment, I'm gonna give myself salmonella. So honestly, you get the last laugh here. And same with you guys. You know, I just I gotta do it. I gotta do it. Uh, at least I got two from one, so we don't have to you know worry about an hey sugar cane. I need sugar cane. Gotta be on the lookout for that. Nice tropical environment for sugar cane to be growing here. Another one over there, a little bit more. Oh my goodness, brilliant. We're gonna have fireworks for days. Love to see it, love to see it. Do I go up on there? I can, I doubt there's a goat, but sure. Hello, goats, anywhere. Also I can eat this and then I can eat this and then I can eat this and then I can eat this and I can save. Well, actually I already have the cooked pork chops so I can eat that. Mmm, yummy food challenge, goodbye. And then I could have just eaten that in the nether because I've had this for a while. Well, 
Anyway, see, that's the thing, right? Like, oh God, the people who do the speed run uh, all advancements records and stuff are just gnarly. I'm sorry, I actually need to do this, man. And how many, it's raw rabbit. I need a cooked rabbit. Oh, that's a baby, I'm pretty sure. So he's not gonna drop anything. Case in point, didn't drop anything. But do the people who do the all advancement speed runs, I don't know if you if you saw on the screenshot that that was showing my progress so far, like six hours, six, six and a half hours is the current record for 1.20. I mean, it's just like the amount of kind of multitasking doubling up that you have to do. And, and there's like some, you have to jigsaw puzzle the whole thing together and kind of like try to figure out, okay, what, what can I do at the same time? And how can I use getting one advancement in order to get me further in the other advancement? And, and, and then, you know, you have to just memorize that whole progression. And then when things don't pan out in your favor, because, you know, Minecraft world gen is R and G, hey, there's a village over there. Maybe I should stop there. Then you have to, you know, adapt, improvise, overcome. It's just wild. All right, we got, yep, double rabbit. Sorry about that, buddy. Hey, but let me go sleep in the village. Um, and then I'll just take a bed because... Yeah, why do we, we don't need to be traveling at night unless we actually might want to find an Enderman. And then that would potentially help us out a little bit. We are getting fairly close. Ooh, I could do, oh, I don't have any emeralds. I was thinking Star Trader. God, this is a really far, oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, let me sleep, let me sleep. I don't want this village to get wrecked in case it, it, I, it can't be the closest village to me. It simply cannot. I need the bread. Um, frick, give me a bed. Give me a bed, give me a bed, give me a bed. But I don't have any fish. I need, what I need to do is I just need to be like carrying fish around on me all the time so that when I do run into a village, I can just tame cats, you know? <laughs> I don't want to get super distracted here. I want to go to the end, do the dragon and all that stuff. Um, but at least we know there is a village and it's a mere like 1500 blocks away from home. But hey, once we have an elytra, it's not that big of a deal. So, totally lost track of where I'm going. I'm going that way and into this, this way. Okay, yeah, well, let me take the bed with me and then we shall continue along and I will probably be seeing you guys later. I don't mean that as like a bad omen or something like that, but yeah, it just depends how things go. You know, Star Traders, I love Star Traders. Star Trader is such a cool advancement, but I need a couple Ender Pearls spare for that and probably, uh, <laughs> Maybe extras, just in case I fail it the first time. Give me more, more sugar cane. Give me all of it. Thank you, thank you. All right, beef tartare. Yummy, yummy. Am I really gonna want to hold all this in my inventory? That's the question. Probably not. So I'm gonna have to. Well, I guess I could like cook it when I get to the portal room. It's just you know, unless I start getting shulkers asap. Oh, there's a village. Oh wait, actually having a village right at the stronghold. Is this Minecraft bedrock? This is really convenient though, because that should be like really easy return trip because we'll have the nether portal set up here and everything. Oh yeah, wait, okay. So 2695, I overshot it. I thought it was 2795. I like this. This is very good. Let's eat some raw rabbit. Mmm, yummy. And anything, oh yeah, the chicken is the next one. Oh, delicious. Nothing like going into the stronghold with a little bit of salmonella. All right, everybody, moment of truth. Did our calculations work out? 2695 and 792, we are basically on top. Please, put out some prayers for us. Okay, it's an overshoot, it's an overshoot, but, but just tell me it's not, not by much and it's not gonna be a breakage. This is always the, this is always the tricky part. Okay, come on, come on. No, oh, this is what you don't like to see. This is what you don't like to see. It was such a far one, right? Like the distance was very far with a small change in angle, which means it's gonna be ever that much more sensitive to uh, any like pixel imperfection on my triangulation. Okay, come on. Oh, this is not good. It's not good, we're gonna get a break here. They're not gonna get a break yet. Oh, please, 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 please. Don't go, don't be super, oh, oh God, it's so bad. Oh, it's just a massive overshot. Oh, massive miscalculation. Like I felt pretty well triangulated, but given how far away it was, I think we just got super, super wrecked. Like there's only so much you can do. Oh, when you're dealing with a salmonella, when you're dealing with the difference of just like, you know, one degree at this distance. Oh God. Okay, there it is, there it is, there it is. Okay, 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 okay. I overcorrected now. Dang it. <laughs> uh. There we go. Come on. Uh, Where is it, where is it? This corner? Where's the, which corner? Is it this corner? 
Oh god, I don't actually know which corner. We have 12. Do I ri the ice has kind of like screwed me up here, but I think we just go for 4-4. Four, four. Do we go for 4-4? Four, four? Oh, do I throw one more and risk the break? I feel like we can't risk the break and I just go for 4-4. Four, four. I'm just going 4-4 four, four here and we we hope for the best. All right, everybody. Uh, no pressure. Oh god, also no pressure with the with the digging straight down. All right. Well, uh here goes nothing. Um shovel, 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 please, please, please. And then let's, let's get our water bucket ready to go and uh, hope for the best here, folks. Be good. Also, please be in the right chunk. God dang it. If it's not in the right chunk, it's going to be so obnoxious. I'll, I'll, if I'm off by, you know, a, uh, I could be off. Oh, thank goodness for efficiency. We made it. I did do the wrong chunk, but holy frick, thank goodness. <laughs> thank goodness we hit. Oh, that could have been really bad. It was the wrong 4-4. Four four. Well, that does mean that I, I have a little bit more of a trick in actually finding uh, the portal room, but that that could have been significantly worse. Way, 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 way worse, way worse. Hugely, hugely worse. Um, okay, that's not an entry staircase. It means I don't really have a starting point to like reference back to. In I hear them. I hear them. We got a smithing template. We got another ender pearl, so we would have been fine anyway. Nothing to worry about here. Let's dump out things, maybe. I do want to see what we get in the chest here. Wait, so hold on. Oh, eh, there we go. Come on, dude. Now that was effective. <sighs> oh my God. <laughs> this may actually be the most pre-filled eyes I have ever seen. So as it turns out, I did not need to be cautious at all about, yeah, anything, really, anything at all. Um, let's make a portal here and that way we'll be able to, you know, bookmark things for ourselves. All right, and this, yeah, this will be a really, really close, easy uh, portal, hopefully, to get through. I guess it depends what direction we end up in the nether through here. Is it somewhere we've been? I wonder. All right, right on the lava. So we are at 300, negative 100, pretty easy chords to remember. And yeah, I'm sure once we have the elytra, it'll just be super easy to get back here. We can always do rooftop travel as well, if we wanted to. I, yeah, I'll just make a chest and put it down here. I know like my wood is now limited in terms of I'll be only be able to make one shulker box at the moment and then have like no wood to replenish any tools or anything, but I'll just throw some stuff in here. I just feel like taking the smithing template and stuff like that is just going to uh, occupy inventory space. So I'll just take that. I can just make, let me make the fireworks. There we go, so we have 24 and sort out everything else. I I guess I'll just spawn here. And then I'm thinking just in case there's a good enchantment inside of the library, I will go back up. I'm just gonna check real quick. Also having the books, that'll be very nice. So, but I, yeah, I think we'll, we'll just spawn back here. I guess I don't really need to do this at the moment since I'll come back and do it anyway. But let's just see, do we have anything good? Power three efficient, I mean, actually applying power three to our bow right now. I don't have the iron, but maybe I can just find some iron veins real quick and do that. We're good, I'm not, I'm not gonna risk doing, um, you know, beds and blowing myself up. So I'm probably just gonna do things the old fashioned way. Infinity, yeah, infinity pow three might might be good. And then we'll have to do some villager trades, obviously, if we want to upgrade it. But, oh God, I'm also at level 26 though. I do I do have enough arrows to be able to make meaningful progress. Uh, I'm torn on if I, I don't need it. I don't need it. And do I want to delay? Let me see how many iron is in this vein. Let me see what we got here. Uh, if, we, if we got enough, we got enough, then maybe, maybe I consider doing it. It's gonna be really embarrassing if I ever go down here, coming to the port room and I just fall into lava. <laughs> Maybe I should make a better entrance. What is that? That is eight uh, combined with the 18. It's still not enough. So I'll just leave it here and hope that I don't re regret it. You know? Okay. We got blocks. We got wood. We got a, a shield. We have an extra ender pearl just in case we might want to get some more of those. And yeah, God, that's so crazy that there's four pre-filled. Okay. Well, anyway. Here goes nothing. I suppose I don't need to keep these on me. And away we go. So I didn't forget anything. All right. 
Here we are, here we are, here we are. I mean, we got arrows, we got a sword, got an ender pearl. I wonder if before engaging, we, we wanna just get a few more in case we get yeeted up into the sky. I, I'd rather rely on pearling to save myself instead of a uh, MLG water bucket, probably. Let me, yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna get a couple more, even though, oh, they're probably, he's probably gonna try to ruin my life here and throw a little dragon's breath down on mid-engagement on, on one of the mans, but here, come on. Okay, a couple, oh, okay, that was a few, that was a few. Please, no dragon's breath. Please don't do it to me. Also, uh, Minecraft 1.21, we are hoping, is the uh, Ender Dragon volume balancing update, but so far, there's no confirmation on that, so, uh, We've still got to reduce the volume. Thank you for the pearls, very much appreciated. Oh, double, let's go. And come on, a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more, please. Pretty please. So, man, yeah, you know, we're playing in the 1.21 snapshot, but I still haven't, I still haven't fixed the volumes. I don't know why the Ender Dragon has to blow your eardrums out, but anyway, boom. Flaw the same, right? Flaw the same. I'm gonna speak too soon on that, aren't I? Got it, okay, well. You know, we only missed one shot. Okay, we gotta be a little bit careful here with the charge that's gonna be coming in a moment. Oh my God, look at him go. Come on, come on, come on. Here he comes. Nope, nope, nope. Miss me, miss me, miss me, miss me, miss me. Thank you. Oh, so close on that one. So close. Come on. I'm missing. Overshot. There we go. Cool. And through the bars. Oh my God. Oh my God. Just so you know, like Minecraft arrows, they've got a little, oh, I've I've made him mad and I don't want that. Uh, Minecraft arrows, they have a little bit of randomization to their uh, path of travel. Just, just throwing it out there for anyone who's like, oh wow, how could you have missed that shot when it should have been really easy? It's, it's because of the game. It's because of how it is. Not because of me though, to just, <clears throat> so we're clear on, on that, I get most of them. I think that one's still up there intact. So, let me, yeah, let me, let me just, that uh, one might be a little bit of a toughie. I got this though, I got this. Definitely, he's definitely not gonna eat me into the sky and I'm not gonna miss my keybind to Ender Pearl back down or MLG water bag. That would never happen, that would simply never happen. Got it. Any others? Oh, you. Got it. I think we're good. Easy peasy. Oh, 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 uh, here he goes. Woo, we're good, we're good, we're good. Please, I got it. Don't yeet, no yeet, no yeet. And we begin. Come on. All right, that was good. How many arrows do we have? About 44. I'm just wondering, like we should probably conserve some just to have until we're uh, infinity up. I wouldn't be saying this if I just applied infinity and you know had decided to make an anvil and stuff like that. But the only difference is playing the waiting game for the perch. I don't even have a bet on me, even if I wanted. <laughs> I don't know if I would. I'm not sure if I would, but I, you know, I'm just thinking about, yes, this could be done faster, significantly so, but it's fine. He's being agreeable or she's being agreeable on the perching. Oh my God, speaking of, I literally just say, oh, she's being agreeable on the perching and then, and then there we go. Yeah, I just wanna, I just shout out to you. I wanna thank you for being so cooperative in the final Minecraft frick. <clears throat> One more hit. Final Minecraft Let's Play here on the channel. Thank you. Oh, we're gonna have some. You know, I, I suppose I should have just spent the levels because I'm getting them anyway after the fact. And now I, yeah, no, it actually, I, I would have probably ended up at like level 69 regardless of if I had done enchantments before coming here or not. So anyway, oh, we, you love to see it. You love to see it. 69, it's like, I. It's like, I know how it adds up. <laughs> All right, everybody, we, we beat the dragon. That's the end, episode three. I've been titling these episodes, but I should probably call this one the end, shouldn't I? Classic. Um, thanks for watching. Oh wait, I suppose actually, you know what we should do is this. Okay, sure. Of all the places, of all the places you could have teleported to, you, you go and do, the, uh, it's gonna be a world spawn, right? Okay, we're getting an elytra. It's fine, we're gonna get an elytra. Everything is good. Make sure to like the video, uh, subscribe to the channel, check the playlist, and um, if you've missed any episodes, you wanna jump into the next one if you're watching this in the future. And I'll see you then.